There we go. Okay. So first, I'm going to just ask, because I haven't seen you guys in a long, long time, how's everything going? And um, one thing I like was interested in is like, has anyone learned anything new this summer? Like, for example, my nieces, they just went tubing for the first time, or um, I don't know, like there are new things to do since you can't go out to events, but there's a lot of fun outdoor activities you can learn for the first time. Did you learn anything new, Cody? Yeah. You know, the, he had never really used a tennis racket, so I definitely would say that was new. Like, uh, even the last session, he's never used, like, tried to hit something with it. So I would say that's a new, I uh, maybe not skill yet, but something that he's trying. So. Yeah, just something different that he hasn't used before. Right. So that's good. And what about you guys, Cherie? Has Enoch and Persephone and the little one learned anything new or done anything new? Well, so we, Bradford Beach has a new accessible path down to the they water. They do? <gasps> yeah, it's, a, it's like this giant blue mat. But so we have been able to go to the beach a bunch of times. And Enoch loves the waves, right? You like sitting in the waves? crashing on you so that was something new we learned oh my gosh that's so cool I remember like reading that they were going to put something down at Bradford Beach for that but I didn't know that they would do it this year but that's awesome yeah, yeah it's really really nice like you wouldn't think it'd make that much of a difference but like I don't think we could make it down there without it honestly yeah oh that's I so can't nice imagine that's Cherie because even Co just one kid Cody and it gets hot, and then you have three kids, and then also Enoch you'd have to carry. Like, that's a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, so it's been really, really nice. Oh, that's so good. Oh, that's so nice. I haven't been to Bradford in, like, a year. Normally, we play volleyball down there, but that's so, that's so exciting. Yeah, yeah, it's right next to that, like, tiki bar. Mm. Nice. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm glad everyone's learning something new, doing something fun during this time. Oh, that makes me happy. Okay, so yes, we're going to do trapping and catching. So again, um, I just like to read the description. So trapping is when children stop a ball with their body and not their hands. Catching is when children use only their hands to stop a ball that is thrown, bounced, or rolled. Both skills require children to watch the ball as it moves and hand-eye coordination. Children also need strength and balance to trap and catch. So there's a lot to do with trapping and catching. Um, so for our warm up, okay, for our warm ups, we're going to be doing a lot of stuff with our arms. Um, I figured we we're going to do a few arm circles. So, green, yep, so we're going to do all the charts and so we're gonna do ten big ones forward. Okay, come on. Red charts. We're doing this first, and then we get to use our. Stars. We'll do ten, ten big arm circles forward, and ten big ones backwards. <laughs> Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now let's do ten big ones backwards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, good job, everyone. Okay, so now we did big ones, so we're gonna do little arm circles. So ten little arm circles forward. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And let's do ten backwards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Um, again, since we're doing trapping and catching, we're going to be using, you know, our core. So I figured we'd do some side stretches. So you're going to lift your arm up, let's say your right arm, lift it up, and then you're just going to bend towards your left. And we'll count for ten seconds. One. Two, hi Benny, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
Good job. Good job, everyone. Lift your arm up again. Left arm and go over. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then we'll do our right side one more time. So right arm goes up. Bend over. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job, everyone. Left arm up. Bend over to your right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job, everyone. Um, for the next warm up, we're going to reach up really high, touch the sky, and then we're going to touch our toes. So we're going to do that ten times. So reach up high and touch your toes. One. Reach up high and touch your toes. Two. Reach up high, touch your toes. Three. Reach up high, touch your toes. Four. Reach up high, touch your toes. Five. Reach up high, touch your toes. Six. Reach up high, touch your toes. Seven. Reach up high, touch your toes. Eight. Reach up high, touch your toes. Nine. Last one, make it big. Reach up high, shake your body. It's Friday, everyone. Touch your toes and go down. Okay. Good job. So, I don't know about you guys, I'm warm. Uh, again, our apartment doesn't have AC, so, anywho. So, the equipment, what you're gonna need today, you're going to need a water bottle. Make sure everyone's staying hydrated some bubbles, um, a couple different balls, a beach ball, balloons, foam balls, whatever you have laying around. And then last but not least, cones. If you don't have little cones, you could use soda bottles. I'm gonna use yoga blocks, actually. Um, so yeah, that's what you'll need, and we will hop into the first activity. So since it is so nice outside, like the chart boys, what they're doing is having practice outside, um, we're gonna do the first activity is called bubble catch. Um, if you don't wanna use bubbles inside, you can use balls and just play catch or use balloons. Um, my nieces used all our bubbles, so I actually don't have bubbles with me. But all you're gonna do is, you know, the adults can blow bubbles and have the kids, you know, catch, and touch the bubbles. So this is working on hand-eye coordination. Um, start blowing bubbles and have the kids swat at it um, when two hands is too easy. Hey, Benny, just have them swat with their right hand. If that's too easy, make them work on their left hand. Um, so yeah, working on hand-eye coordination. We'll do this for five minutes. Um, maybe a little bit longer so Cherie can blow the ball up. <laughs> um, but yeah. Have fun with this, work on hand-eye coordination, and we'll meet back in a little bit. Yeah, or just play catch. There you go. Good idea, Camden. Jenna, I ran and got the bubbles. I'm assuming we're just trying to get the bubbles. Is that what we're trying to do? Yeah, we're going to work on hand-eye coordination right now. So have Cody try, you know, swatting at the bubbles. When it's easy for him to swat at bubbles, you know, then he can work on one hand. I'm going to mute everyone real quick except Andrew. Hi, Andrew. Hi, Jenna. How are you? Doing great. Good. It's good to have you on. So we started practice, so for you to catch up if you want, we did a few um, arm circles forward. We did 10 of those. Then we did some, 10 arm circles backwards, and then we did little arm circles. So make sure you're warming up. Um, I'll do actually arm circles with you guys while um, everyone else is doing the first activity. Sound good, Andrew? Okay. 
Okay, Andrew, I'll do arm circles with you while everyone else is catching bubbles. So let's do 10 big ones forward. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, let's do 10 big ones backwards, Andrew. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, Andrew, can you do little ones and lead us in that? Good. Okay. And what about ten backward small arm circles? One, two, three, four, four, five, five six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, good job, Andrew. Um, the other thing we worked on were side stretches. So you can stand up and do that. You already put your right arm up, then you bend over towards your left, and then you can count for 10 seconds. Go ahead and count for us. Good job. Now use the other arm and bend over. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And the last warm up exercise we did, we did, yep, you can go over again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Last time on this side. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. The last exercise, warm up exercise we did is we touch the sky, put our hands up, you know, shake our body around, and then we would touch our toes. So we did that ten times. So touch the sky, touch our toes. Touch the sky, touch our toes. Shake, 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 and touch our toes. Shake, 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 and touch your toes. Shake, 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 and touch your toes. Shake, 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 and touch your toes. Okay. So, you feel warmed up, Andrew? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so what everyone else is working on right now is hand-eye coordination. So if you have any bubbles or if you have someone there with you, you can play catch. So Cody and his mom are playing catch together and working on hand-eye coordination. Same with the Purdy family and the Chart Boys too. Hold on, hold on. And we'll go for two more minutes, you guys. Two more minutes. Good job, everyone. Good job, Cody and Tammy. Yep. <laughs> nice job, Bunny. Keep throwing. Good job. <laughs> right, right here. Good throwing, Andrew. Right, thank you, Jenna. Nice job, Enoch and Persephone. Yeah, good job, Enoch. Keep throwing, Bunny. Hey, keep throwing. You're doing good. Good job, everyone. A little bit longer, and then we'll move on to the second activity. Keep working hard, everyone. I'm going to go get my phone to record. Okay, you guys. Nice job. Nice job, everyone. Good, uh, good work on hand-eye coordination. Okay, so we're going to move on to the second activity, everyone. And what we're going to do for the second activity is the goalie drill. Oh, goalie drill. Goalie drill. 
So you're going to have your kiddos stand in front of two cones. Remember, if you don't have cones, you can use soda bottles. I'm going to use yoga blocks, anything to make, you know, a goal. Um, pillows are a good thing, too. So just set up the cones, pillows, whatever you have, and work on um, the kiddos stopping the ball. So you're going to either throw it to them or you're going to roll the ball to them, and they have to trap it with their hands or their feet. So I'd say maybe work on them with feet first and then move to hands. So we'll do this one for another five minutes. Ooh, Benny's got a legit goal. <laughs> It. Work on this for five minutes, you guys, and then we'll move on to uh, the next activity. I'm going to set my block right here. I have to go get a ball real quick. I'll put my timer on you guys. You guys just keep working on going <laughs> through the group, trying to score a goal, okay? Oh, I got a goal. That's one. Nice job, you guys. Ooh, good job, Enoch. Way to stop that. Keep on kicking, Enoch. Good job, Persephone. Oh. Yeah, but you're trying to prevent me from doing it. Nice job, Andrew. Okay, five minutes, or I will go 4.30 right now. 4.30, starting now. So keep working on your skills. I'm going to get a ball quick so I have practice on my goalie skills. You got a goal. <laughs> Okay. Well, that's too slow. Try to get it faster. Good job, everyone. Okay. Ooh, I did not score. Okay, this time, you go this way, and I'll try to use try to Kick. Oh, the Nice job, you guys. Boom. Oh, I got a catch. You hit it down, so don't go through the goal. All right, and then. Whatever, five, sister. Good job, Cody. Hi, Bill. Mm -hmm. You gotta go to the side. Yeah, wait. Like that. That's cool. Let's go, Benny. Good job, Andrew. Thank you, Jenna. Mm hmm. Good hand eye coordination. My <laughs> sister. <laughs> Ooh, almost, Benny. Yeah. Keep working hard, you guys. Nice job. Yeah, yeah. good job, Enoch. Yeah, Benny. Nice job. Good job, Benny. Trying to get a bowl? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Way to stop the ball, Camden. Good footwork. Oh, you got it. You got a bowl. Keep kicking, Enoch. Good job, buddy. Here, you try to stop. Oh, good job. Oh. Nice job, you guys. Oh, almost, Benny. Oh, 
Good job, Cody. Good job. Persephone's throwing the ball over Enoch's head. <laughs> hey, you guys, nice job. 45 seconds left. Work hard for 45 seconds. Stop it. Go. Oh, almost, Benny. Yeah, good kick, Benny. Okay, nice job. <laughs> Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good job, everyone. How's the Heinz and Lambo, Mom? I really liked everyone. You guys did a good job. I saw a lot of good things with using your feet to stop the ball or using your hands. So good job. Yeah, good job, Benny and Cam Camden. Good thing. Yay. Nice job. You're welcome. Good job. Okay. Before we move on to our last activity, we are going to have some water. So we're going to take a water break to make sure we stay hydrated since it's a bit hot outside. Okay, so everyone make sure you take some water. Six, right, Mom? Yeah, Mom. Water breaks are very important to make sure we're giving our body enough fluid. Burger won the Lombardi Trophy. Ben Roethlisberger won the Lombardi Trophy in 2006. Did he, Andrew? Yeah, <laughs> Jenna. That's, that's a fact that I'll now remember that I did not know before. Ben, Big Ben's the MVP. Yeah. Andrew, what agency do you participate with? Special Olympics. City. Spring City. Yeah, but what team? Badgers? No, Spring City. Spring oh, City. Spring City. So you're in Waukesha. Yeah, we're in Waukesha. Nice. Okay. You're not far. Cherie and the Purdy family from Glendale. Cody's family is in Milwaukee. And the charts are in, in New Berlin. So we have everyone in southeastern Wisconsin today. That's fun. Okay. So we're going to move on to our last activity, and it's going to actually be a challenge. So we worked on our hand-eye coordination already in the first one. So we're going to go back to that, um, but this time we're going to see how many times um, you guys can catch a ball back and forth between each other and what your biggest number can be. So for five minutes, you know, make sure you're counting how many times you can catch a ball back and forth between each other. And whoever, um, just whoever has the highest number gets a big round of applause. Um, and just challenge yourself to see how many catches you can do in a row. Okay, you guys? Okay, you gotta get me. Uh, and Benny, I bet you guys can get really high. All right, we gotta try and catch, okay? It's fine. Alright, Ben, you guys catch. Yeah, Mom. And you guys can either do low hand throws or oh. low hand catches. Um or high hand catches. Whatever works for you guys. Okay. Now you gotta catch. Okay. Oh, good job, Benny. Nice catch, Benny. Oh. Yes. One, two, Oh, back up. Okay. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, nice throw, Benny. Back to you. Good catches, Andrew. Oh, throw it again. 
<laughs> nice job, Cody. I will start the timer. <laughs> Big Ben. Oh. Big Ben Roethlisberger. Hey, you made me. Big Ben is the MVP. <laughs> I know. Focus on counting and trying to see how many you can get, Andrew. See if you can get up to 100 catches. All right, Ben, come here. Good catch, Cody. And good throw. Good throw again, Cody. Oh, Enoch got it with his head. Yay. And you. Good job, you guys. If, if catching is too hard, you guys can also work back and forth with trapping. So if catching is too hard, you guys can kick back and forth towards each other. Nice catch, Camden. All right. Uh, almost, Benny. Okay, let's go back to one. One, two. Oh, yeah, good catch, Benny. Oh, Benny, you got Ooh, good throw, Cody. Good overhand throw. Good catch, Cody. You guys are doing great. <laughs> Nice job, Persephone and Enoch. Nice job, everyone. Good job, buddy. Go catch, goofball. Buddy, go catch. Oh. You gotta catch with your hands, not your face, silly. Oh, there you yeah, there you go, Bunny. Yes. Yay. Okay. Cody, you gotta catch it, you silly guy. Good catch, Enoch. Nice throw. Woo! Good catch. Good job, everyone. Keep working hard. Everyone's doing good. We have about a little longer than a minute left. I Keep working it. there, Andrew. How many are you getting at, Andrew? A hundred. You got two hundred? Good job. Keep going. <laughs> Camden's rolling around. <laughs> oh, gosh. Good job, you guys. Keep working hard. Oh, good balancing, Cody. <laughs> Okay, we're almost done, you guys. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And you guys are done. Yes. Good job, everyone. So I'm going to unmute everyone. I want to see how many catches everyone got or trapping with their feet. So, 
Let's go with Cody and Tammy. Well, we didn't really keep track because he was, he likes catch like trapping and throwing, but it, I mean, we didn't really keep track, but I thought he did really well with, um, we had him start throwing at the cones and he really enjoyed that. So then he was catching them when I threw them to him, but then he liked knocking the cones instead of throwing them to me. <laughs> but it was fun. Good. I was going to say, when I saw him, he did a good job catching. He was yeah. doing a good job. And, and he struggles with catching. So that was awesome. Yeah. Yay. That's good. Awesome. Right, well, good job, you guys. Yeah, go get him. <laughs> okay. Purdy family. How did you guys do with it? We got 25. Wow. That's a lot. Nice job, you guys. Clap. Good job. <laughs> Yay. Okay. Benny, how many catches did you guys get? Eleven. Eleven, yeah. Eleven? That's a lot. You guys yes. did really good. <laughs> 150. Nice job, Andrew. That's impressive, too. Well, everyone get, deserves a big round of applause for yourselves. Good job. I'm very, I like everything I saw. Everyone was catching well, strapping well, and everyone had a big smile on their face. So that's all that matters. So good job, everyone. Okay, well, that was our last activity. Take a little water break if you need it before we do our cool down, and then we'll do some stretches, and that will be today's practice. We got to head out. We got to head out a little early. We'll see you, Jenna. Thanks. Bye, you guys. Enjoy your weekend charts. You too. Thanks. Okay, you guys, so let's see what I have for our stretches. Oh, okay. So the first stretch we're going to do is a forearm stretch. Since we did a lot of stuff with catching today, we're gonna do forearm stretch. So you're gonna put one of your arms out, like you're giving someone a high five, and then you're gonna take your other hand and gently, not really forcefully, but gently, Pull back your fingers to get a good forearm in your stretch, or stretch in your forearms, excuse me. You don't want to feel any tingling or any pinch, so just a little stretch. And we'll hold that for 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. So now with that same arm, you're going to flip it, and I kind of have weird elbows, but you're going to flip your hand and then just take the other one and pull the other way. Remember, you don't want pinching. This shouldn't hurt. It should just feel a little stretch in your forearm. So again, we'll count to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Good job. So now we have to do our left arm. High five your imaginary friend or a family member. High five them. <laughs> Take your right hand and pull your fingers back a little bit. Get a good stretch. And Andrew, do you want to count to 10 for us? Yes. Okay, can you count loud and proud? Yep. Okay, go ahead. One, two, three, four. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. And now we flip our hand upside down and then pull our fingers back a little bit. And Andrew, do you want to count for us again? Mm -hmm. Go ahead. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. Okay. The next stretch we're going to do is called a pike stretch. So I need everyone to sit down on their butt or, yeah, sit down. Put your legs out long. I'll back up. Put your legs out long. And all you're gonna do is reach over and touch your toes. So we're gonna try and get a back stretch and a leg stretch. So you're gonna reach up to the sky, reach, 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 and then touch your toes. And remember, you don't wanna feel any shooting pain, just a little stretch in your back, 
and back in your legs. So I'll count this time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we're gonna go up again and do it one more time. So go up, touch the stars, touch the sun, the clouds, shake it up, shake, shake, shake. And we're gonna touch our toes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, good job. And we're gonna do a few other stretches. So next one we're gonna do is a neck stretch. So you're gonna take your neck, take your right ear, and gently put it closer to your shoulder. And we'll count for 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice job, let's go to center. Now go the other way, whether it's your left or right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That felt so good, we're gonna do it one more time on each side. And this time when you're bending your head down, if you want a Deep, a tad deeper stretch, you can also put some pressure with your hand. So right ear to right shoulder. If you want a little bit deeper of a stretch, just gently kind of lay your hand on your head. And again, we'll count for 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Again, center. Good inhale, exhale, and left ear to left shoulder. And then if you can, if you wanna make it deeper, hand on your head and apply a little bit of pressure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Okay. And if you've joined us before, you know I like to always end with the goodbye wrap. So we will play that. You guys are done, you can log off. But if you just wanna sit and sing to the song, go right ahead. I am going to start that. I gotta share my screen. So one second. Ah, oh, here we go, share screen. Share computer. One second, you guys. Okay. I apologize, I did not have this already pulled up for you guys. Monster Math presents Addition Below 10. Okay, class, let's begin. Okay, I need to skip. What that. is 5 plus 3? We can solve. Bad. Goodbye song from the award winning CD Brain Breaks Action Songs Let's Move by the Learning Station. Let's all say goodbye in a fun, silly way. It's how we end a happy day. Now stop, 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 and clap, clap, clap. Repeat after me in this goodbye rap. See you later, alligator. See you later, alligator. Got a truck, baby duck. Got a truck, Got a truck baby duck. duck. In a shake, rattlesnake. In a shake, rattlesnake. Out of here, reindeer. Out of here, reindeer. Let's all say goodbye in a fun, silly way. It's how we end a happy day. 
today. I hope everyone had fun um, trapping and catching. Feel free to use this, you know, during the week when the kids are got to get some wiggles out. Feel free to use exercises. Um, the only reminder I have for everyone is on Tuesday, I'm doing a craft show. It's going to be one of those calming sensory bottles. Um, so if you want to join for a craft, please feel free. The supplies are on um, the website. So if you go to the event calendar and go to whatever next Tuesday is, I think it's the 25th, um, feel free to join the craft and make a sensory bottle. I'm really excited to make it with everyone and hopefully you guys would want to join. So everyone have a great weekend and we'll see you very soon. Good job, everyone. Claps all around. Thank good you. job. Good job, Purdy's. Good job. Nice job, Andrew. You're welcome, Jenna. <laughs> Keep working hard. <laughs>